Welcome to the Skyward EA Plus Teacher Module Training. In this video, I will be showing you how to log on to Skyward and also basic navigation of our homepage. If we click on our Skyward icon, we will be brought to our Skyward login page. You will log into Skyward with your same username and password that you use to log on to your computer. You will not need a domain to log into Skyward. So I will type in my username, followed by my password, and click the sign in button. We are now at our Educator Access Plus homepage. In the upper right hand corner, we'll see our username, some basic account information, and our preferences link. If we click our preferences link, we have a few options here. We could change, for example, a larger font size. We could change our background color. I'll change mine to purple. And if we save this, now every time we log into Skyward Educator Access Plus, those preferences will be saved and they are also user defined so they will only affect your profile right next to preferences we can see our exit link and that will log you out of skyward so we will not click that at this time and next to our exit link we can see our question mark button if we click our question mark button and scroll down to sky docs sky documentation and click that it will bring us to our skyward documentation page which are just some basic tutorials and manuals that you can refer to during your use of Skyward. Right below that we can see our My Favorites link. If we click that, I currently do not have any favorites. If we want to go to our teacher access and go to any of our links here, I'll go to My Students. And right next to our title, we can see a little star. If we just click the star, now that will save it into our My Favorites. So if we go back to our home page, now under my favorites link I can see the my students link and I could easily access that by just clicking it there. If we go back to our home page next to my favorites is the new window. By clicking the new window it will just simply open up another window so I can navigate between two screens. I'll X out of that and next to it is the my print queue. The my print queue will be where all your reports are stored and I will get into that in a later tutorial. Right next to our home tab, we see our teacher access tab, which is the default for all teachers in the district. Based on your security credentials and current position, you may see other tabs, for example, a student services tab or administrative access tab. And that concludes this video on basic homepage navigation. Thank you for watching.